All right, folks, welcome back. It's moved me over here when I loaded back in. <laughs> How's it going? Um, yeah, we're in a new area of can of wormholes. We've been learning how to worm around. Um, and then we hit a dead end at that point. I think the dots on this represent the number of puzzles in the area, and these are un like unsolved puzzles. There's a fast travel, like to anywhere. Oh, yeah, oh, well, that's cool. That's nice, like as long as it's an accessible room, I can get there. That's neat. Cool. What else was on the map? Select room, I see. Yep, got it. All right, uh, let's do this. Let's just go in the order that we see them. I think that makes the most sense. Uh, there are two worms. Okay, what happens? Oh, I just push you. Okay. Okay, I just push you. I was expecting something else to happen there, but no. Uh, I want you to get to the other one. Yeah, I get the trick here. I want to get you past... Uh, okay, let's get out of the way. <laughs> I'll get you past, and then presumably I have some way of lifting you up. Of course I do. Then I have a way of going it around. But it's nice that there's like... There's a symmetrical way around at the bottom, so I could have gone either way. Uh, and then I go in this one. Cool. Because I wouldn't have been able to back into the other one on the right. Uh, I didn't say that as I was doing it, but something I noticed. Uh, okay. Hello. I see there's battery slots here as well. They already have batteries in, so I guess I don't care about them? I don't know. Okay, okay, so these are going to be bridges as well. I wonder if the dots, the little pellet things I was eating, I wonder if they're just like one length worms. Huh. It's, it's possible. Okay, I'm gonna assume that I want these to be... Um, ooh, so I can't go off the edge, of course. Um, how would I ever... I don't think I could bring these back down then. Right? Yes, that's correct. Uh, no, that's not correct. Because I could do... Uh, would I be able to get that back though? Maybe? Like using this? I mean, uh, yes, and then I think I can push you onto that. No, I can't. At that point, then I think I'm stuck. Hold on, let's not overcomplicate things. What, what is the distance I'm trying to cover? I guess I press V, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. They can cover a distance of six, and then because I'm too long, I can cross the gap at the end. Okay, so I do want them to be uh, end to end from here. Not necessarily exactly end to end, but like pretty much. Okay, it needs to come away from the wall. And to get it away from the wall, I have to lift it up first. I think I do something with you right now. Like maybe move you down, in fact. Yes, bring you across. Um. I still can't get through. I, I could have moved you further down. Now I can come through. Mm, I don't think this is good. Yeah, because now I can't move you that way without the falling in. Uh, how far can I move you up before I lose access to you? Basically there. Which is how it started. No, that's not how it started. They both moved up one. So that's at least better than was, but then I can't lower this down, right? Uh, I, I guess what I'm wondering is like, can I possibly use one to lower the other at some point? Hmm. Ah, <laughs> I keep trying to do that. Uh, I guess if I lower... No, if I lower you here... Well, if... Okay. Is there something I can do if... If I bring you over this way? No, there's not. But I can't like bring that in any further. Like I potentially could hook that around the other one and then bring it back to the left, but I can't bring that down at that point. Um, okay, so that's not good. Am I overcomplicating this? Or do I, maybe I, no, I'd have to move you up or down. Where do I move you to? 
can move you there, but then I don't think I can get back onto you. So I can move you there, and then I could do... No, I'll fall. And I can't bring you in on the, on the side because I'm only too long. So let's lift you up then, I guess. But lifting you up is also bad. Push you further away. How far can I push you? That far. Does that help somehow? I think that's what I did the first time, right? Or is it not? And I'm just being silly. I think it's not what I did. But I'm just being silly. <laughs> okay. Uh, and I do this. Don't fall off. Okay, there we go. Okay. I definitely did overcomplicate that. All right. Uh, sometimes I see other bits of the level and think it's like another level or something else to interact with, but like that is just the, you know the other platform in that level. It's just weird when the the, the overworlds around them. Okie dokie. Uh, so I'm going over there. I'm three long, and you're going there, and you're, you're the right size. There is a dot there. The dot's going to help me cross. Understood. So we need to use you as a little hook mechanism. Go down there, grab that, bring it over, but not there. Okay, so we want to, there's an extra trick here, is push it around this side first. Oh, uh, don't fall in. Push it that way, then we hook it here. Da, 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 da. And then you go into the space. Neat. It's the kind of trick I was like thinking I might need to do in the previous one. Like use one of the things to hook the other thing. But it came up there instead. It's getting ahead of myself. Alright. Uh, uh, hello, what? Some diagram. Well, there's a screen that I can't see. I want to see this screen. Maybe it says the same thing. Uh, so what are you saying? So after time... What? A worm not on the platform disintegrates. A worm on the platform does not. Is that what we're saying? Can I, is there something I can do like with these? What if I like throw out that thing? <laughs> I'm trying to like hook it on stuff. There's one here as well. The mushroom. Oh, it bounces off the mushroom. That's cool. Ah. Okay, so it's just a room with some screens in it. I can actually sort of see what's on that screen. What is it? It's something different. I don't think I can rotate. That's my map. Is there like a rotate camera thing? Can I use my mouse? No. Huh. There's something there that I can see very slightly like this, but I don't know what. Okay. Wait, what happens if I can I throw a thing at like the switches on the side? I see those switches. No, okay. <laughs> no, hello worms. What are you up to? Oh wait, I've got new legs here. I didn't even realize. Okay, they're still all open. Go. So presumably at some point in this world I'll get more of the other symbol. I'm not sure how that's indicated. Let's go here. It's so strange that you aim at the level to go in. Alright, what is this? Um, so we need three twos. Yep, and then one, four, and four threes. So I'm going to become a three. One of these threes is going to become a four. Or I'm just going to become a... Yeah, it might just be me going over there to get the two things. Hmm, which way round? I don't know. So right now I can only recover, like... Well, in fact, I can't even do that. So what can I do right now? Uh... And like push one away, that's not useful because I can't loop around the edge. 
how do I even start bringing these up? Because I also can't go over. I can cross that space. That's all I could do. How do I start lifting these? There are the edges. So I need a hook somewhere, right? I can push them down if I want. I don't think that helps me grab any of the others. Oh, except they could go in the... I could use them as a platform, but then they're gone. Wait, I, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, there are, there are eight slots, so I'm not losing any of these worms, including myself. Uh, You're against the edge. What do I do? Being at a corner doesn't help me grab you. Being on the edge, I can't grab you. Obviously, I can go in the slot, but then the, the level's over. <laughs> what on earth could I be missing here? Those dots can't help right now. I guess the dots aren't worms, because they're like also flashing. It's like its own thing. It's, it definitely can't be the case that I'm like pushing one into the off the edge because then it's never coming back one two three four five six seven eight one two three four five six seven eight there are two things up there and so the, and the total lengths are what i would expect but let's just add up the total one two three four five six seven eight nine ten and twelve eighteen twenty and then the two uh dots as well that's twenty two one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two. Okay. Uh I am miss clearly missing just something really silly, aren't I? I need to lift one of these away from the edge. I cannot do it like this, because I fall off. One of them sticking out doesn't help me lift one away from the edge. They can all shuffle each other along like that. But then I just end up pushing one off. Is there some move I don't know? Or is it a natural consequence of everything I've done so far? The little entrance thing doesn't count as a space. That can't go in there. We need them all. What? I can't like worm my way over this. I can't go up this way. I can worm to there. Oh, I can! I can worm my way over this. This is cool. That's very clever. I love it. That's smart. That's super smart. Do I grab both or just one? Because uh, like it's pos. No, but the other things can't eat. Okay. And <laughs> uh, no, I can just go across. Okay, that's really cool. That was excellent. And now I can just push them. And it's probably not that complicated to get everything set up. It's slightly gross when the thing's closed and then the stuff splatters out. Uh, we can put one of these there. Whoa, that was a cool little realization. It felt like there was absolutely no way I'd be able to, okay, uh, to like wiggle over those gaps. But the little seams between the gaps, the trick. Okay, cool. Uh, one of these has to go like up to the top. Along, like this. Nice gross noises. You go here. Yay! That was cool. Okay. It's the color of the worm determined by... It's not even a worm, it's like a... Well, this isn't a, like a millipede, but it doesn't have enough legs, but it's more millipede-like <laughs> with its legs. Uh, does the color of the worm depend on the disc that I throw? Maybe. I should keep an eye on that. Uh, so I just need to fill in that with only the 
three. So like, oh, right now I can't get past these, but I can throw these off. Go around this. Do that, bring you back. I'm gonna fall. Okay, but something like this. Ah, <laughs> then I fell in. Uh, yeah, okay. So how, how do I do this without falling? Like, mm, I can't push that off either. I can push you there, but then that's against that. Oh, what if I'd done that one space earlier? And then, yep, yeah, here. There we go. Neat. Very cool. And we're just like filling up. <laughs> we're like extracting the worm juice, putting it in the thing. It, fill, it sounds like it's filling up like a cup. <laughs> And we get a little symbol that we can take away with us. Where are we going? Okay. Sure, we'll do this. Yeah, orange. Orange worm. We've definitely had different colored worms at different points. Okay, so I need to be one longer. That's not going to change shape. As far as I know, I can't change the shape of other worms yet. I expect it will probably come up at some point. Uh, what are you telling me? So if I go in here, we're going to have problems escaping, right? Yeah, okay. Yep, that's problematic. Um, so I need a way in and back out again. Well, does that fit there? It does. But then how do I get it back? I guess would be the question. I don't think I can. Can I? Hold on. No, it couldn't be pushed down or anything. I noticed this space here. Uh, I could push the ball. Ooh. Oh, this can't be good. I'm just going to be stuck out here now. So I need to be that length. I need to escape again. I can push this thing left and right. And that is going to help somehow. Maybe. I cannot make my tail go down in this area without going out here. But then I'm stuck. So the question is, how do I get the, the little ball and leave? Well, so at the beginning, if I push this leftwards, it doesn't give me access to it. Uh, is there something weird about, uh, not that, about this? Nope, okay. Got to test interactions that I haven't done. It's like, it's like I want to use this as a way of like moving the ball somewhere. I'm sure I can do this, but then I can't escape because I can't move the thing back to the left. So I can't go over there, but I have to get the ball and leave. It can't go to the left, so I... That is weird, isn't it? How's that going to work? I... know it works. I do this and do... No, I can't lift you up. Okay, I don't know how it works. <laughs> Could I lift you up? You've got three, a gap of three. No, I can't lift you up in either space. So I obviously can't eat that and go into that. But if I shuffle the thing over so I'm not getting caught by that, then the exit's blocked. Is there some way it would become unblocked? I don't think so. Okay. Of course I could like push ball elsewhere. I'm trying to see how that helps. Don't think it does. Because I'm still trapped. Once that's there, I'm trapped, right? I think so. But I also don't want to go into that space to eat it. It's like I want it's, it's like I want the thing to be. Does like blocking that up somehow help me? I need some way of backing up. Okay, I need some way of backing up two spaces. More specifically. up 
two spaces. Like if I could turn the tail downwards, that would be nice. Like here. But it wouldn't be right unless I, oh, hold on. What would it be? No. This game also has um, Sneelian's kind of aesthetics to it as well. Oh, oh, okay. Didn't I try this at some point? Oh, it's when it can't be pushed. Oh, okay, okay. I'm learning a very new thing here. Uh, <laughs> that's kind of horrendous. Uh, oh, that lets me go further. Okay, okay. I have to learn a new thing. That's the, that's the tricky thing with puzzles is like, you sometimes don't know whether you're learning a new thing or whether you're just trying to have some insights about, you know, like with the things that you already know. And that could be tricky on both sides. Like in that puzzle, because I didn't realize I was looking for a new thing, I was like looking for some way of maneuvering around the stuff that would work. I was like stuck on that. Um, but then it can also happen the other way around, uh, where I'm like, there's, there isn't a new trick to discover. I just need to do something simple, like the stuff I already know, but I'm thinking like, maybe there is a new trick. And that's like distracting me from finding the solution. Okay, what's this one? Hey, worm. Um, fences, walls, there's this worm here. That would push you. If it, is this gonna be the area about slipping onto another worm? <laughs> sure. Uh, we need, I'm three, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I need to eat all the things. Yep. Okay. Uh, right now I cannot get around to any of those spaces and get past this worm. Let's push you along then. And then I, I think I see what's going to happen. Maybe I'm going to push you along until I, mean, I can go to eat that now. At some point I'm going to get on this worm, aren't I? Oh, I get, I'm going to get on it down there. Yeah, okay. Do I want to eat that yet or not? So what happens? Can it, does it pop out the other side of me? No. Ooh. So, to get to those, what if I now like try and go up? There's a little bit of like figuring out what, what the options are. Can I, I can't get around here, right? No, it's not far enough. Or it's too far, sorry. What other ways would I go onto this one? Do I necessarily want to? I'm not sure. That's also going to be too far. Going on to it down there seems like it's bad. I don't think I'd ever get that worm back, like the dead worm. Oh, weapon's very press left now. Nothing. Okay. I do need to check like nothing weird happens in certain cases. Okay, I think it's just blocking the path then. In which case. What are my other options? I don't think I have any. <laughs> I can't do anything over here yet. I cannot get around to those other dots down there. You are in the way. I had to push you along. Did I have to push you along? Are there are other options. I can't slip on here because of that. Is there a way to make it so that I do slip on this side. <laughs> Saying slip on is like, <laughs> it's awful. Uh... Oh yeah, does it matter about which length I am? Like if I'm shorter, does that help me in some way? Doesn't appear to. There's no weird moves I can do here. I can just eat this, or I can move it back, maybe. Mm, not, I can't really do that. Okay. Huh, what kind of move do I think I'm gonna be able to do? Wait, I, so I did eat another one, so I am, oh, so now I'm actually long enough to do this, right? I am. Oh, okay, then I can push that along that way. Got it. Then I can reach the other one. Uh, not the other one. 
So with this distance, I can go around the other side. Okay, that's cool. That's neat. <laughs> and then I can't slip off this, so I need to somehow have some other approach here. Can I... Oh gosh, I got myself stuck, I think. Oh, do I just turn around? I don't use that. I go, uh, 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 there we go. Yeah. Cool. And the way the layouts, the, like the level layout structure makes you think you're going to each of those dots in that order, but you're actually sneaking around that wall at the bottom. Cool. Whew, this is going to be a challenging game. Uh, there's worms there in the corners. I've got to go over a worm to do something, so that's going to limit how far I can stretch into that area. That makes sense. Um, I'm going to end up being... Uh, three longer. Okay, there are three dots. Okay, so it's about like how do I get to the dots? I'm guessing like if I go to this one first, I can't reach any of them. That seems to be the case. Yep. So first we go to this one. I can at least reach that dot. That would then let me reach the other one without doing anything else. Like why bother moving those around? Why don't I just get as long as I can, then figure out how to reach that one? And that one is. Oh, okay. Uh, can I do that without getting stuck? Well, maybe not. Because I'm always going to be too long to back back out of there, right? That is true, okay. Well, isn't that going to be true in both cases? So is it a matter of I have to get both of these dots? Uh, hold on, hold on. Uh, is that resolvable? If I'm like turned around there, no, because I always extended that point, all right. Okay, it's gone here then instead. Uh, obviously I've got these as well, that will somehow help me. Uh, I mean, I could push things closer. Uh, why won't that push that way? Oh, because I'm stuck here, okay. Uh, but I could do, uh, go back, uh, even push you further up, go like this. Yeah, so that's closer on that side now, so I would be able to reach that thing and get back out uh, if I did. Although maybe not enough yet? No, not enough yet. Um, so maybe I push you the whole way. Like that. Get back out. I can always get back out of that one because of the gap at the bottom where I enter the puzzle. Um, is, is this good then? No, also not good. Okay, maybe we do that last. It's possible. Ah, maybe what I do is use this one to... So right now I can get out of this, yes. So I can like push this around as much as I like. That feels good. Let me go and get... Oh, I can't get out of this because I extended by one. Yep. Okay, can I... I can't reach that with this. I can push it down. I don't think that helps me though, right? Because I can't do this without going all the way onto there. I guess I, I guess I use the other one to help somehow. But I can do this. Move all that down. But I'm not going to get out of here. That's the problem. Okay. So what if... So if I've eaten even one, we have a problem. I think once I've eaten all three, I'd be able to get out of here, right? So like, let's just test that. So if I were here, if I were one longer in eating, I'd extend such that I would be able to do this. Ooh, would I? So I guess my tail would be... Oh, I'm extending forwards in that case. Right, yeah, that makes sense. So... My tail would be pointing into the space that's currently below the tail, and then I'd be like going back. Oh, that's oh, really hard to measure actually. I don't think I'd be able to get off there, right? Hmm. So how do I un... How do I disconnect after eating too much? There's also that hole, as though maybe something gets thrown into that. That feels a bit weird though, why would that be useful? And maybe I just eat them all from this side. That's possible, right? 
Maybe I use the left side. That's okay. That's just. What can I do from this left side? I can push you down. And that's about it. But then maybe that's good. Okay. That's the only thing I can do from there. Oh, don't fall in. Okay. Then we find some way to. We can at the very least eat you. We can't reach you yet. Can we reach the other one? Not quite. What if we had. What? Okay, so before we eat anything, we do some maneuvering to get that one to the left. I think that might be what's going on here. I could push something further if I was able to, but maybe what I do is I push that thing down, it goes in the hole. Then I keep that going to the left. I, maybe I keep swapping between these two sides. Uh, actually, I think I lift that up. Um, lift that up from here. Like, I need to go... No, 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 hold on, hold on. I pushed up further from the side. Oh, but I can only get it there. I'd like to lift it up. Could I have lifted it up earlier? I also feel like I'm doing something wrong with the other one. Yeah, I really feel like I'm doing something wrong with the other one. But I don't see how I'd lift the other one up unless I can reach it with like this. Don't think I can. Nope, nowhere near. Yeah, so I don't actually see how that could come up. But once I've hit this, I can't go in on the left hand side anymore. So. Even for the third one, I think. So I think I must eat them all on the right hand side. That's an interesting level idea. If I'm eating them all on the right hand side, okay, maybe I'm just setting something up, like getting you in there. And then I just start eating them and then using that to help me. Well, I think I'd still struggle to do anything with you, right? Hmm. That needs to have moved that way. Let me reset again. Let's go back on here. So if I eat this, can I... Nope. Can't do anything. And if I do eat you and then leave again, let's just double check. If I eat you, leave. And I go on here, I'm not getting back off, right? Well, I mean, I would be able to fit and go all the way, but if I go... No, like, if I go any further than... Yeah, if I go in, I'm not getting it back out. That is 100% true. Okay. Because of the, like, amount of space there is here with the fence next to it, I can go in and I can push that around if I want to. But that doesn't feel like a useful way to push that. I can push that around if I want to. Uh, but I've eaten the thing, so that's not good. All right. <clears throat> then what on earth can I do? At most at the beginning, I think I can push the thing down, right? Yeah, okay. That seems to be the most I can do. I can then push this where I want it to go push it down. It's hard to judge exactly what I would be able to do. I still haven't eaten one, so I could push that left, but that would, sorry, push it right, but that would involve like having pushed it up, but I can't push it up. Yeah, I certainly can't push it up from here. There is no, okay, but I guess I can do other stuff with you here-ish. I can do this and that. Maybe I can make both of those accessible on the other side. And is that enough to reach over to the other one? 
Yes, okay, there we go. There we go. And then we make a shape on here. Woohoo! Tricky. Very tricky. Alright, uh, I think we'll leave that there. Um, what's this map looking like? Okay, yeah, we're getting an interesting structured map as well. Was that an elevator? It looked like an elevator when I was in it, but then the doors themselves just like look like normal doors. I'm not quite sure. Um, wait, oh, and there's a way down here as well. Perhaps to another area with different symbols, or perhaps to another part of the blue. That could be possible. Okay, and it's showing us the different numbers of symbols we've got on the left there as well. Neat. Cool. All right, see you next time, and we'll continue leftwards probably. Goodbye.